Michael, we're not gonna invite Michael because it's Michael. Are we sick? What is this? Oh God. Magical greetings, it's Elena, and welcome back to the channel, guys. So today is episode five of the High School Series Let's Play season three. Oh my gosh, I feel like we are blowing through the series. I'm sad because it's gonna end soon. This is my first Let's Play, so it's like, it's like a really sad thing to see it go by. But everyone's like enjoying all the episodes so far, and I'm I'm just hoping that you guys keep enjoying it, and it's like still fun and it's not boring or anything. So um, last episode. Sam moved in with us and we also got engaged so she's like super happy and that was literally like yesterday so she's like having the best day of her life everything is great dandy rainbows unicorns all of that fun stuff so what we're gonna do is we are going to plan I think tomorrow it's today's I mean we could tomorrow today so Saturday we are going to do a bachelorette a bachelor a bachelorette i don't know why my brain could not say that we're gonna do a bachelorette party because she's getting married and this is her last like time like last i guess months days i don't know so we're just gonna throw one for evelyn plan for sam to have his but like they'll be doing their own things so i don't think it really matters but we're gonna invite madison obviously we're going to invite um mia i forgot to I forgot about Michael, not gonna lie. I forgot about Michael. Well, hopefully he doesn't die or anything before the party. If not, I will like fix that. So Mass and Mia, we're gonna invite Mia. We're gonna invite Michael. Noah's gonna come, Ophelia. I, this is a bachelorette party. So usually like people invite girls, but like Noah's, Noah's been with us since like day one. Like I'm gonna invite him, whatever, who cares? Michael, we're not gonna invite Michael because it's Michael. But like Noah, Noah's been our bestie for the resties. Uh, obviously Amber, G and Hannah are gonna come with us, duh. Um, we are also going to invite, we have a lot of friends. What's going on with this? And we'll invite Jamie because everyone needs a Jamie in their life. Private dancer. <gasps> we can invite a private dancer. Sorry, I'm trying not to scream into the mic. We can invite a private dancer. Oh my God. Okay, 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 okay. We can only have one maximum. Okay, obviously, okay. She's bisexual, so I don't know if we should do a woman or a man. The, ah, this is this is gonna be hard. Should we do a man or a woman? Let's let's just scroll through the list and whoever. Okay, we're gonna do Annika. Okay, we're gonna throw a bachelor party for Sam, and obviously he is the bachelor. And we're going to invite. Okay, Noah's coming to ours, so we can't invite Noah. We're gonna invite kentaro i don't know who that is but yeah june peter he knows on oh he know sam knows annika sam knows annika then that that's weird okay we're not gonna do annika as the stripper or the 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 whatever and oh i also want to show you guys the outfit um we're gonna ignore my cast background i i don't okay I downloaded a new cast background and then I already had one, but I cannot find the cast background file that I already had. So they're like conflicting with each other. And I've been looking for the other cast background that I have downloaded in my mods folder for a long time and I cannot find it. And I'm trying to get rid of it because there's the other one I downloaded is just a lot cuter and I'm just upset. So this is why it looks like this. It looks stupid because I, yeah, can't find it. Anyways, these pants are kind of cute. Anyways, that was besides the point. So I already made a bachelorette um, outfit. So this is what she's wearing for her bachelorette party. Isn't this cute? This is literally so cute. This is so cute. So I liked her how her hair was kind of just like, I don't know, I might change the hair, but I feel like it really goes with the rest of the outfit. It kind of pulls it all together. So this is her little bachelorette. It's so, oh my God, it's literally so freaking cute i am in, in love with it so it's already 10 52 and since we don't have to do anything till 8 p.m we're gonna go to the store our shop and we're gonna try to open it from i think from 10 to 3 is a good or like 10 to 4 might be a good time um we might actually we might like i don't want to do it until like eight o'clock because that's when her thing starts so i think we might do it until um 
maybe five or six. Six is good. We'll do six. We'll do until six. Okay. Who is Deborah? Hello, Deborah. Great customer. Hello. Welcome. Welcome to the store. Welcome to Sweet Petals. How can we help you? How can we be of service to you? Would you like to buy some some food? Preferably, you can buy the Ambrosia. Just don't ignore the price of the high thirteen thousand. It's not. It's not that bad. You can afford it. You'll be okay. Oh my God. We we've made nothing. Nothing is happening. They're. <gasps> yes. It is. It is great value. Yes. You should buy. Yes. What do you want to buy? Who? Who? Where? Who are you? Who are? <gasps> of course. Let me ring you up real quick for you. Let me go ahead and help you with that. Help you with that order. You want me to wrap it up? Give it. Put a bow on it. Ooh, banana bread. Okay, good choice. Good choice. Awesome. All right, we're going to go ahead and close. We made $700. That's not really like good, but it was wor it, it would it could have been worse. It could have been worse. So that's that's a good that's a good starting amount. Oh, we have 6,000 points. Real quick, I want to buy a perk. What is the perk that I want to buy? I think it was faster faster checkouts. That's what I wanted to do. Because I feel like the checkouts take so long. And when I was playing this like nonstop, like I there was a point where I was doing the the retail thing like every day. And when I was doing that, a lot of the customers wanted to why go home. <laughs> a lot of the customers wanted to buy stuff, but I wasn't able to do it because I had to um I had to like help check out everybody and like I don't know, it was a lot. Oh, the toilet's broken all right guys this is the start of the bachelorette party i'm literally so excited okay so first off um we're just gonna make sure that we say hi to everybody before we even start the event um so we're gonna oh okay joke about wedding night with um g we'll joke about our exes with noah um we'll like you know say hi to Ophelia. we haven't seen her about like in forever uh, we haven't seen Madison in forever. Oh my god. Let's um joke about wedding night to Madison. She, of course she got her drink. Oh my gosh. Announce engagement. Tell everyone that I'm engaged. I feel like they probably already know. That's how we got to this point. But you never know. Oh my gosh. It's like the old the old gang is all here. Oh, his bachelor party is starting. That has nothing to do with us. What is announced asked to be in wedding party? I don't know. Okay. I would okay. Who would I ask to be my wedding party to begin with? Um, G, you changed your outfit. No. Anyways, we're gonna ask G to be in our wedding party. Um, we're also gonna ask Madison to be in our wedding party because like yeah, we dated, but we've been like they're like best friends now. Like you know, it just didn't work out. Like them being together, it just wasn't meant to be. But like they're still friends. So, um, I don't know. Can Noah be in our wedding party? I don't. I think it has to be a female actually um we asked g we asked ophelia i mean we asked um uh, madison who else should we ask uh um i don't know uh we can ask amber amber when we're in our wedding party i don't know how people can be in our wedding party we'll just ask i'll ask the uh, ask for marriage advice she's not even married is she married wow i'm speechless oh wait they've been saying stuff this whole time i didn't even see it okay Wow, I'm speechless. Wait, does this mean I can be your maid of honor? Oh, I don't know about all that. Okay, so we have the girls lined up to be in our wedding party. Awesome. Um, oh, but there is a whole like spot over here where everyone's supposed to be hanging out, but they're not. Not everyone's over here. Uh, sit and chat. Who is this? Oh, it's Mia. What the heck? So there's this whole little spot out here that has her wedding stuff. So it says, welcome to the bridal shower and she has her bride to be and all her little like gifts and cakes and stuff and like a, a heater and then like you know everyone's supposed to be hanging out over here this is where we're supposed to be because she rented out this little spot at the lounge for them to hang out and like to chat and they were like not over here okay i added some more lighting because it was really really dark and i'm gonna probably like delete the lighting because it looks kind of weird like this bright but like it also looked kind of weird that it was that dark so i don't know it was a lot let's all go swimming mia is over here getting plastered we haven't drank anything we've just been chit-chatting with all these people which is fine also this is our wait a minute isn't this our private dancer christopher you have not been dancing ask for private <laughs> let's ask him for a private dance i wonder what's gonna happen i'm scared gonna dance for us christopher she's like go ahead don't be shy Oh my god! 
It's literally, and then she's like, she's like getting turned on. She's like, oh, that's hot. Like, what <laughs> about that was hot? It's like 3 a.m. So we're gonna go ahead and end this. I don't know how long it's like that thing is set for. And it said that someone like they left us stuff in our inventory, or was it? What did it say? Oh, in our in our household inventory. Oh, we probably got some. We got some wedding gifts. I'm kind of excited. I don't know. What do they give us? Can they even afford that? Like any of that stuff, actually. Now that I think about it. I'm pretty sure half of them don't have jobs. What did we get? We got a Unity swag. Unity swag. Okay. Celebrated with the with your wedding day with this beautiful wall hanging. Congratulations. Oh. Oh, we got um his and her champagne bottles, and a. And we got. Cute. <laughs> All right. So before we go to sleep, we're going to. You know cliss cliss what the heck am i trying to say we're gonna kiss our our fiance is what i was trying to say we're gonna kiss our fiance good night and then we're gonna go to bed and wow okay all right guys all right that was great go to sleep please Oof. i'm still laughing about <laughs> the private dancer <laughs> That was literally hilarious. Oh my god. Anyways, all right, go to bed. Go to bed. We have things to do in the morning. Okay, so it is now morning time. What is this? Um, clean up. It is now morning time. So we're gonna go ahead and make some breakfast for me, Sam, and I. I was gonna say me and Sam. Sam and I. We're going to make fruit crepes because we can. And I wish I could eat a crepe right now, but I can't. So I'll make it in The Sims. And I guess that's supposed to make it better. Not really, but we'll pretend. Okay, so what I want us to do today is Sam and Evelyn are gonna go house hunting. So they're gonna, you know, they have money saved up. They've been saving up a lot of money. And eventually they wanna like, you know, once they get married, they don't wanna keep living in this, you know, it's not, I was gonna say janky, but it's not a janky apartment. It's a, it's a very nice apartment, actually. I, I, I kind of outdid myself, not gonna lie. Um, but they wanna, you know, move to a new house and, start their their life settle down all that so today we're gonna go house hunting and we're gonna look for some houses and see if we can find one that we want to buy the crepes are done oh my gosh it looks so good all right so i will say that all these houses are in willow creek um i might end up moving what um all right so all these houses are in willow creek i eventually probably am gonna move them somewhere else but like right now i just picked willow creek because it's kind of like the suburbs but like you know yeah anyway so these are the houses we're gonna look out like whoa these are the houses that we're going to look at today we have five houses to look at and i think we're gonna start with this one and then we'll just like kind of move throughout and hopefully these people are home and if they're not home i'm very upset because then i can't go inside all right so this is the first house blue suburban home there's no window right here for some unknown reason but this is kind of cute i kind of like this house it's very like cutesy and simple i wonder i don't know i don't even remember what these the, the these houses even look like not gonna lie okay so the floor plan okay i kind of like this oh <laughs> someone's grief this is so unprofessional oh my gosh okay i kind of like the layout the the backyard is a good size the living room and everything how many rooms does this place have oh just one okay we probably won't be living here because there's only one bedroom and that's not enough for how many people are, are going to probably live here anyways we're gonna move to this house this one's so cute okay guys so my game literally crashed i don't <laughs> I don't even know like how or why that happened. I'm gonna go ahead and save real quick just in case my game decides to crash again. My game has never crashed before. This is like maybe the first time it's done this. But anyways, um, let's go ahead and look on the inside, get a little house tour. Okay, freeze. So this is the inside. Um, okay, we have one, two, we have two bedrooms so far here. Um, is there like a, oh that's it oh this is it oh um okay so we have two bedrooms one for us and then one for a kid possibly maybe a little walkway a kitchen area okay this this house might be a look a maybe we have a nice big yard which is nice but this house might be a maybe because there's only two rooms and like that's it i don't know i was just expecting more 
because it just looks so like grand you just would think i thought there might be like a little downstairs i don't know i was just expecting more so maybe not maybe not this house all right let's check this one see how this house looks i'm seeing that this house is a pool that may or may not entice me to want to live here maybe i don't know we will we shall see and hopefully this one can possibly go on our list of like yeses i feel like we only really have like one yes right now which is this house but like that like this is like our last resort house like i don't know a last resort okay so we have space in here in the garage so this could possibly be something um which i kind of like that i don't know how we would do that might would might probably have to get rid of like the bathroom here i don't know but i think this is cute though this is a possibility i like that and this could even be like a separate little like house like it doesn't even have to be like a part of the actual house but this could be like a little side place like oh yeah we could okay we could do something with this so living room kitchen area okay bathroom someone died rest in peace you um okay a little okay wait this is kind of cute we have a little we have a lot of space back here in the garage in the like backyard area like not a ton but also like not too much um okay and then we have three bedrooms okay three bedrooms is great and then this possibly being what i was thinking about maybe a second house like if our kid gets older maybe they could have like their own little like apartment area without actually like being on their own or something so that's cute i like this okay so this house is a definite yes i definitely like this house so far and i i don't think it'll be too expensive either and we have a lot of room so i like that okay so we're gonna visit another house just to make sure i say visit everything before you make a decision because what if you say yes to this house and there was something better okay so this is our fourth house i think our fourth house tour all right so starting off i like the front and i like the little basketball court like i think that's cute oh i think it has like a little oh can we not can we not can we not say hi is that not the front door is this ooh, is this the front door that's the front door we can't get there though if she can get there i'm gonna be very surprised oh what i don't know how she did that but she somehow got inside of the backyard okay anyways so here is the first floor we have a little um, dining room area. I kind of like that it's separate. We have a lot of space in the garage, which is a great, we have a crazy amount of space. Oh my gosh. Okay. Bathroom, kitchen, living room area. And then, I mean, obviously the backyard. Um, upstairs. Wow. Okay. We have three bedrooms again. This one is a bit different because we can't really do much with the garage. Like we can't build a house on top, but having three bedrooms already is great. And then we could probably make this into a bedroom if we really wanted an extra bedroom. So, so far, okay, I kind of like this house too. Obviously like we're gonna have to like touch it up cause it looks kind of crazy right now. But so now I'm stuck. This is hard. Okay, this is the last house we were visiting, so maybe this house might entice us a bit more than the other ones, but those- I'm stuck between those two. I kind of like them both. This is hard. But I feel like the first one that we, that we liked, um, the one with the garage without the- without the room on top, I feel like that one could be cute, but then we would have to build on top of the garage eventually but the other one already has like see this is, this is gonna be hard this is gonna be hard anyways this is the last house that we're looking at very very simple house i really like the way it looks on the outside I'm not gonna lie it's so cute okay let's see all right so we have a little nice big deck we have a garage space area a coat closet which could be turned into like a bathroom or something which is nice um okay we have very big living room space like a huge living room space so this could definitely be changed into something we could probably add a wall here i don't know but this could definitely get moved into something else kitchen space dining table cute oh there's oh wow okay we have a lot going on in the backyard what the heck we have another basketball court we have a pool back here okay i like the backyard i like what's going on here and this could be definitely turned to a bedroom we could definitely make a bedroom here if there's not already an oh there's definitely enough wow okay yeah this room this is this house is definitely going to be the house that we're gonna probably buy because 
we have a lot of space in this room and i'm guessing this this is probably the master i think or maybe this one i don't know there's a lot going on here we have a workout room two rooms upstairs we have, we have wait so we have four rooms upstairs three which are bedrooms one which is like a random workout room which is cool and then we have the possibility of putting a room here or here and then we have a room we could put a room here so we have a lot of space so i think this this house might be the best house because we have a lot of space so which means she could have like a ton of kids if she wanted to she could also have like i don't know i just feel like having extra space is just nice in case like her parents want to come over or like if the grandma has to, like you know just like if things happen i like there's enough space and then also i like how there's like a little community garden right here so even that's really cute i feel like this whole this this area is like this is perfect this is perfect okay so this is the house that we are probably going to save up for so we're gonna first see how much this house cost oh a hundred thousand dollars is how much our dream house costs and then this house is sixty four thousand. so this is affordable we can like we're literally four thousand away so this is this is a house that we can definitely buy and it's honestly these houses are kind of the same this one just has more like building room but this one has what we already want but this one's like perfect how much is this one 75 okay and this one is thirteen thousand. yeah it's definitely giving thirteen thousand. <laughs> <laughs> definitely gives 13,000. Okay. Me saying that they're going to be getting this house means I'm going to be playing this game for hours. Anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching the fifth episode of the High School Series Let's Play Season 3. I hope you guys really enjoyed episode 5, and I hope you guys are going to be super excited for episode 6. It's going to be amazing. I cannot wait. I hope you guys are excited as I am. And I think we only have three more episodes until the series is over. So get your tissues ready it's going to be ending soon which is so sad my first let's play is going to be ending i i don't even know how to feel like i feel like this let's play definitely put me on the map and got got me to where i am right now so it's like it's kind of sad like that's it's gonna be over but hopefully you know the next let's play and hopefully growing together let's play um keeps you guys entertained until i can come up with another one i want to try to do something um different I was gonna do like a cottage living let's play but i feel like that's kind of like i don't know kind of over with so like if you guys i really do prefer let's plays but if you guys have any other suggestions on videos that you guys want to see please comment them down below um i'm okay if you if you comment some challenges that's fine because there's probably a couple that i've probably haven't heard of and definitely probably want to do and could probably put my own spin onto it as well um but yes i wishing you guys a ton of magical moments and a ton of magical days and i'm so happy that you guys are here again i know i keep repeating myself but i'm just like so 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 grateful for you guys because without you guys i just couldn't i mean i don't know i just couldn't be as happy as i am so just thank you so much for bringing a smile to my face and i hope i also bring smile and you know joy and happy vibes to your face as well um and i'll see you guys in the next episode goodbye <laughs>